Conway, South Carolina is located 15 miles west of Myrtle Beach, and the historic city is an important part of the Grand Strand despite its more inland location. Conway is the county seat of Horry County and is unofficially known as the gateway to the Grand Strand, as many people who are visiting the Myrtle Beach area need to travel through Conway to get to their destination. Conway is a small town, but it is busy and it is proud, and we're gonna check out what it's like right now. Hey, welcome back, and if you're new here, my name is Nick, and on this channel I talk about things to do here in Myrtle Beach, I give tips and advice about the area, and I'm a real estate agent, so of course I talk about the real estate. So if you're thinking about relocating to the greater Myrtle Beach area, then be sure to hit the subscribe button down below and tap the little notification bell while you're at it, this way you can be the first to know about what's going on here in Myrtle Beach. I get calls every single day from people just like you who are moving to the area, so if you ever have any questions, or if I can help you find home here at the beach, then I would love to chat with you. You can always use the first link down in the description to schedule a call with me. Now, I know I said that Conway is small, but the greater Conway area is actually huge with many of the outside areas being very rural. And at the center of it all, you will find the historic downtown with so much to do. From the scenic Conway Riverwalk, which is a mile and a half boardwalk, traveling along the Waccamaw River, to the Theater of the Republic, to the many great local restaurants, you can spend an entire day exploring this small town. And before we continue, be sure to hit that thumbs up button down below and make sure you stick around until the end because I'm gonna be giving a sneak peek of my newest listing, which is located less than two miles outside of downtown Conway. Some great local restaurants in Conway include Crooked Oak Tavern, Hoppin' Witch, Cooper's, and of course, the Trestle Bakery and Cafe. Also, a new pizza shop just opened up right in the downtown called Anto's that people have been raving about. So that's definitely one on my list to check out, but you really can't go wrong with any of these options. And I think the main reason that people love living in Conway is because it has that nice small town feel while still being close enough to the much busier Myrtle Beach area. You are well outside of the touristy hustle and bustle, but when you want to spend a day at the beach, you can do so because it's just right down the road and you can get there within about 30 to 45 minutes depending on where in Conway you're located. Conway is also home to Coastal Carolina University as well as one of the three Ori Georgetown Technical College campuses. One of the coolest parts about Conway in my opinion is that in October it turns into the city of Halloween as they decorate and completely transform the town for the holiday. This goes back to what I said about the town being proud. And on top of all the decor, there are also Halloween themed festivities and events that are held throughout the entire month of October. Now, Halloween isn't the only holiday that the town goes all out for, but it's definitely the most popular. And now that we've learned a little bit more about the town, let's go ahead and check out my new listing that I mentioned that again is less than two miles from all this fun. Okay, so we just took you through downtown Conway, checked out all the fun Halloween decorations here in October. And now we're at my newest listing just outside of that downtown area. We're about a mile and a half to two miles from downtown, just a quick five minute drive. And we're gonna go through this one real quick. Nice, neat little house, fully remodeled. It's a three bedroom, one and a half bathroom. You walked in to the living room here. Nice modern kitchen, that big area for a dining table. Really nice countertops, brand new stainless steel appliances. A little laundry area here, some closets, pantry as we head down the hallway here. And then you got your three bedrooms. Again, this is my newest listing here. Three bedrooms, one and a half bathrooms. And this is being offered at $250,000. One of the best parts about this home, again, is it is just about a mile and a half to two miles from downtown Conway. Not quite walking distance, though you could do it if you really wanted to. 
And here's that little half bathroom. So this would be considered the primary here. Yeah, easy access to all of those great restaurants that we just talked about in downtown Conway. You're only about 30 minutes to Myrtle Beach and everything that Myrtle Beach has to offer. You can get to the beach in about 30 to 40 minutes or so, depending on the day and the traffic. So if you have any more questions about this one or Conway in general, if you're ready to find your home here at the beach, then I would love to chat with you. You can use the first link down in the description to schedule a call with me. I'm looking forward to speaking with you. I wanna thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Thank <laughs> you.